ACT Test 101. Students all over the state are starting to stress and prep and think about those ACT tests. So I brought in my brother Garrett Muse. He's an administrator with the Granite School District, former principal, to chat about the do's and don'ts. I know my daughter's taking this test just in the next couple weeks. That's right. It's well, coming just up. The word ACT starts making me sweat, and I'm an adult. <laughs> you remember taking it? I remember because it's it's a little bit scary. It's, it's probably the biggest high stakes test that these kids take in, in school. It so means a lot. You say high stakes. Why is that score so important? The ACT score is very important for kids to get into colleges and universities as well as get scholarships. I give you an example, and we'll probably talk a little bit. My my son actually just took the ACT again and raised his score by one point, which moved his scholarship up to a three-quarter scholarship at a university versus a half scholarship by one point. One point That's did that. That's a big deal. I didn't know that. Okay, so you said taking it again. How many times can you take or should take the um, ACT? I, I have heard of kids taking it over 10 times. Um, I don't know that that's necessarily beneficial. You know, sometimes if you say, if I just do the same thing and I haven't really done anything to better prepare myself, you may be just throwing money away and throwing an afternoon of testing or morning of testing away. But there are so many things that, that schools do. Now, right now, you may be a little late if you said, I want to go take a course and I'm taking the ACT in two weeks. But, but there are so many courses uh, and that almost every high school offers some form of a course that you could take, sometimes within school, sometimes before school or after school, as well as the state even offers um, a system like Schmoop that is paid for that kids can go online and, and practice. Some kids buy the books and they take the book. Garrett, when are we taking the ACT? What grade? It's the junior year. Junior year. Now, but you can take it take beforehand. Take it as a sophomore year. Okay. Uh, I, I've met with people who take it their sophomore year because they, or the beginning of their junior year so they can get a trial run. And it doesn't hurt you. That first score doesn't, they don't send both scores. They send your best score to the college or university. And that has to be by the end of your junior year? Um, no, you can take it again your junior year. People, in fact, my, as I just told you, my son is a senior and That's he just right, took, he the is test, a senior. took the test um, just this fall. Is this the greatest indicator of, like you said, scholarships and colleges that you can get into? It's this score on this test? Well, I think they look at a lot of things. They're going to look at your, they, they obviously look at your GPA. But they'll look at ACT because you know they, everybody doesn't have the same teacher and things aren't the same in all the classes where the ACT nationally, everybody who takes the ACT is taking the same test. And so they, they'll look at the ACT and they put a lot of weight on that. Um, but they do definitely look at what, what courses you took. Did you take rigorous courses? Mm. Did you take AP courses? Did you take concurrent courses? How prepared are you for the university? And they'll, so they'll look at that type of thing, but they'll then also look at the ACT. So parents out there thinking my child is going to be taking it probably in the next maybe year or two years. When should you take a course out of school before that junior year test? A lot of times I, I find a lot of the schools, the high schools that I talk to, will start having them take that course in the fall so it's fresh. Okay. Other students will take, for example, I, I know students who've taken even a university course or they'll take other courses, but you, usually they'll start on it about six months before. And what do they do in those courses? They give them, uh, the teachers know the ACT prep material, and so in those courses they'll start you on a run through. A lot of times if they put you on the computer, the computer will test you, and, and as you fail a question, then they'll revert you back to show you you need to study this part, and they'll, they'll help you to kind of master it, keep working you forward until you're ready to, to pass the test at the level they want you I to pass I don't remember it. having prep courses like that. I don't either. No. I, I don't think I took one. What if your child is discouraged about their score? What do you recommend parents say to them about taking it again or building up their confidence? I, I mean, the nice thing about it is, is, yes, the final one is very important, but it's okay to, to have a struggle a little bit at the beginning because it's an indicator, okay, I need to get some help. So if you took it and you say, oh, I'm not real happy with my score, that doesn't mean that's going to be your score forever. Just like on any test, if you took a test and said, boy, I, I didn't really know that this was going to be on the test, but if the teacher says, well, go ahead and take it again, okay, then now I'm going to go back and study what I didn't know. So. Um, and that's the same in, in my son looked at some of the things and he said I want to go back and I want to master these particulars so I can raise my score up. Oh, I'm proud of Trace. Good for him. Good job. So, Did you help him? 
I, I definitely could have, but he didn't know. But. <laughs> but he's on his own. That's what I'm trying to teach him about life. He actually, he actually did take a course. So. Good. Okay. For all this information on ACT to watch this again with us, go to abc4.com slash GTU. I love it, my brother. And y'all's bangs show. are so I cute know, together. We're twins. We're twins today. You are. I love it. 11 years apart, you look just the same. All right. Thanks so much, Garrett. Coming up next, we're headed to the kitchen. Stick with us.